What is going on YouTube? Stealth Penguin Gamer Girl here, and today we are starting a brand new Sims 4 series, which uh, is on the same lot as my Kirby Pasta Adventure series, or at least the first household. Uh, yeah, biggest lot I could find, um, and today we are doing something uh, different, but I haven't done it in a while, which is why it's it's so exciting. This was originally going to be the brothel challenge, which I haven't done in ages, and I did that with the ugly brothel challenge. That's actually what started to get um, my channel going, is is the ugly brothel challenge, which Stucky, there she is. There she is. She's a lot, she's a lot prettier now. She's, uh, she looks like she's staring daggers at sex pelican here. Uh, I don't know why. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, so yes, we're going to be doing the brothel challenge primarily, but then I decided, you know what, I kind of want to, you know, spice it up a little bit in a, in a different way, sort of sort of add to it, and a lot of people will be like, why you no pregnant challenge no more? So I was like, well, okay, I can do both. I can, like, have some, some pregnancy in here going around and stuff, because, I mean, we are eventually going to have to make a quote-unquote second generation of our, our, our stunning prostitutes here. I, I look like I've got shades, but I, I don't. Freaking EA, like, fix this glitch. I, I mean, I know I'm cool, but I'm not, like, swaggin's cool. See, I'm, like, even bad about it. I'm like, ugh. <laughs> so, yeah, if you don't know the basics of the brothel challenge, which I've actually tried to look this up, but nobody has reiterated it, for, you know, The Sims 4, so it's obviously gonna work a little bit different, so it's like, oh, you gotta have trade sets, and you gotta this and that, and yeah, I don't have those trade sets, and I can't have five traits anymore, but anyway, the basics of it is, is to start with barely anything, you got, you got that down, you, know, you got nothing, nothingness, a lot of nothingness, and we're supposed to build the basics of our, our little brothel, and have some essential stuff. It's supposed to look like really shady, so I'm gonna try my damnedest to make it look like, oh shit, you don't wanna go in there. You might get you might get stabbed. You might wanna get get away from here. You don't wanna get you wanna get stabbed in in your neck skin or something. I don't know. <laughs> so we're gonna start from there and eventually um woohoo our way. And every time we woohoo with somebody, we get uh, to use Kaching. Which will give us a thousand dollars. I'm gonna throw this into play so they can just explore. Be free! Be free, Sims! They don't even give a shit. Oh my god, it's like they know they have nothing. <laughs> okay. Okay. Uh, anyway. So, every time we woohoo, we get a thousand dollars. If we have a trait in common, or they're quote unquote rich, which I don't think there's much specification. Get out of here! That's. I don't think there's much specifications as to find out if they are indeed rich. It does, it's not like a staple like it was in 3, so I might just cross that one out. But anyway, if we have a trait in common, we get to do it twice, so that means $2,000, yay for us. We're not allowed to bang the same person more than once a day. Where are you going, honey boo-boo? She's like, I'm done with you! I am done with you, people! God! So... <laughs> What else is there? After, like, certain amounts of money that we've earned, we get different things. So, we, we're we starting off with $20,500. So, I think that could get that could get us the essentials. Uh, so, if you haven't figured it out already, these are obviously characters from my other series. Why is she sleeping? What the fuck, honey boo-boo? What you doing, girl? Well, anyway, so, we've got me. Which is great, since I was in the prologue. Snooki, obviously, since she was the founder of the Ugly Brothel Challenge, so we kind of had to have her. I didn't make her so much ugly in this one, but that was a personal choice. I felt like in the beginning of The Sims 4, I, I kind of wanted to make her more pretty. Uh, Sex Pelican from my Sims 3 Let's Play. I've already seen her. I think, I think I had her in my first Let's Play. And then we've got Honey Boo Boo, who's sleeping on the bench over here. For absolutely no reason whatsoever. She was in my Sims 3 Hun Honey Boo Boo Chronicles, which is this weird pregnant challenge sort of randomness. That that's basically what I assume this is going to be. It we're going to have a brothel, we might get pregnant from time to time, and it's just going to be madness. So, I do believe I it is time for me to make our 
our shady ass house. And I will be back when that is done. All right, we are back. And this is our shady house. It has absolutely no windows whatsoever. Awesome. So, yeah, that's not creepy as frick. That's a total uh, red flag right there. Because you go in there, you're like, oh, shit. If someone pulls a knife on me, there's no way I can look out to the window for a random civilian to be like, help me. Help me. Anyway, so, yes, this is our house thus far. Uh, I just use cheap flooring everywhere. Ah, oh, look at that. A cheap floor for the win. I actually was able to get farther than we usually do. Like, in the Ugly Brothel Challenge, we could barely color the outside of our house, and now we have siding. Yep, look at that. We were moving up in the world. Anyway, so back here, you're probably wondering what the hell this is. This is our children chamber. I couldn't make it any bigger, because I didn't want to use too much money. And now we have almost $600, which, you know, give or take, that's decent. Yeah. Could be doing better, could be doing worse. Uh, I wanted to do a fuck you chamber, but there just wasn't enough room um, with the amount of money that I've got. So I just said, hey, yeah, we're doing pretty good. So we've got a bar because that was mandatory, or at least I think it was, in the third one. And back, in, back in good old three. So I did that. We've got the penguin TV, of course, because I mean, why not? Penguins are fabulous. Obviously, this is my room because it has an easel and I'm an artist. Um, I don't think I'll use it. I think it'll just be there. And if I make anything, it'll just go up on the walls because I can't be making money off of it. Now that I think about it, that was a horrible mistake. Over to go, Pango is making money, you, you secret snarky bitch you. I don't know. So whoever else's rooms are, I don't, I don't know. They, they can pick. I don't care. So they're, they're pretty drab at the moment. But that's good. There's nothing you can pay attention to while we're getting it on. So, yes. Go. Be free. So, I'll go a bit more into the rules. Is we're only allowed to get with the um, passers-by. And, yes, before anyone asks, yes, I, I do have the new outdoorsy retreatness fucking heater. <laughs> or furnace. I'm, excuse me, I do that all the time. Oh, it's my heater. Uh, no, Pingu. It's a furnace. Dumbass. I'm sorry if that comes on throughout the time of our recording here, but it is negative five degrees outside my house, so that tends to happen. Yeah, that's just a common occurrence. Anyway, so yeah, there's Snooky Douche Fist, of course, and then I gave Sex Pelican in the last day- uh, excuse me, if I could speak today, oh my god! Uh, I gave her the last name Anal Pounder, uh, same for me and Honey Boo Boo, we are the Anal Pounder Triplets. I am just setting things on fire. What the frick? This is not safe. I felt the need to have this here just because it's, it's out in the front and everyone could see us having fun and shit. And everyone's like, oh man, I wish I could roast marshmallows. Boo hoo. I'll never be able to get it on with the marshmallow bitches. Yo, what are you doing? This is not the homeless challenge. Get your ass home, honey boo boo. Get home. Go on. She's like, what? <laughs> Oh, who are you? So yeah, we're only allowed to go out to get customers at night. I don't know how we're going to be able to get sent home because the rules say that we are supposed to be sent home if we find a police officer while we're out scouring for customers. Um, and there's no blatantly, obviously, police sims, um, as far as I know. I mean, it's not like you're going to go to the park and someone's like, yeah, the police officer. So I, I don't know. That, that might be a little bit different, but if somebody passes by or visits us, we are certainly allowed to go get them, which is a hell of a lot more often than it was in 3, so I might have to handicap that to only a couple per day we can get with, like maybe one or two per, per, blah, 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 per, per prostitute. Hey you, you look like you're having a bad day. That nerd is like, hey, cheer up, bitch. Your prostitutes moved in, man. It's looking up. It's looking up today. What are you doing, sex pelican? Tell us. You're telling a story about yourself, and the TV has frozen. I'm just sitting here like, oh my god. I just want to watch the news. Shut up. Who are you telling this story to? Is anyone even listening to you? 
You're- she's a crazy wench. That's all you need to know. Boo-boo, for frack's sake! Get over here! Come on, run! Run! You're not running! I made her lazy. <laughs> so, I don't expect her to run anywhere unless a bear from hell that's on fire and and rains baby bears of death. I doubt she'd run. So let me see where the traits are. Yes, she's childish, lazy, and romantic, and alluring because the lover aspiration. We all have that. Seemed like it fits. I have my normal uh, traits here. Creative, outgoing, and a geek. Snooky is insane, a snob, and romantic. And then Sex Pelican is a goofball. Romantic and insane. They're all crazy. It's just the way it was. They, they, they've always been wacky sims. Hopefully this time we won't have to deal with people sitting on the toilet to eat salad. Because Snooki was a huge offender of that. But I don't know. It's a different game. We might be able to move past it. I don't know. But yeah. So it's, it's going pretty good. Is anyone going to visit us? Why did we leave this burning? What the frick frack? Like, what if this burns down our house? What if some freak wind says, oh, Yes, I am going to fuck up your day, and blows it right into our house, and my room would be first. You assholes, let my shit burn first, God. We're not allowed to buy a, um, oh, what's it, a fire alarm, until, like, we get $5,000? Or we'll earn it and have it in bank and have it spent it on upgrading. So, yeah. It's, my stuff is important. <sighs> Here's our shitty ass foyer. I said, well, we're in a professional brothel. We need a foyer. It's a blank ass room that you walk through. Good job, Pingu. You know what you're doing. House building and, and whatnot. So, make drinks for everyone. Uh, make that. Oh, shit. That costs money. WHY DOES EVERYTHING COST MONEY?! You're the bane of my existence. Why is no one sitting? I'm like, screw you. I'm sitting my fat ass down. Snooky, stop. Oh my god, this is just gonna be attack of the I smell my armpits and hiss. Attacks, cause they're all insane. I'll be like, why do I put up with you people? What are you doing? You just- Oh, you're actually talking. I thought you were, like, just sitting there, like, I'm just gonna sit here with all the alcohol in the world, and I'm not gonna give it to anybody. Oh my god, Boo-Boo. Boo-Boo! What are you doing? What are you doing? Doing with your life. She doesn't even know. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. Let's see if there's anybody interesting passing by. Uh, you... Uh, what's your face? Your name is Cassandra. I'm so glad that they actually tell you the ages now. Because since they're the same fracking height teenagers are, as adults, it's like, hey, baby. And they're like, I'm underage. I'm a minor. Um, yeah, sorry if all of a sudden the gameplay got lower. That would be because I randomly just lowered my volume on my PC. It was uh, getting to me. I felt like I was shouting too much. I mean, I shout too much to begin with, but still. So, we're just watching this frozen screen. As though it's the best- Don't think about fire! Well, think about fire, it'll happen. We do not have a fire alarm for at least five more people we need to bang. Okay? Do you hear me? You're not even gonna take one? It's just Snooky. Snooky's just like, I'm gonna- I'm down for it. Me! Quit watching the amazing penguin and and grab a drink. Drink it. Drink all of it. Yes, steal it from everyone. There's only two. You made drinks for everyone and there were only two glasses. Can we only afford two glasses? Is that really all we can afford? Oh, we can never throw a party. We only have two glasses to serve wine in. Oh no. Oh. Worst house ever. We don't have shit. We don't have shit in here. <laughs> okay, well, let's scour. 
this area. Hey, you. Yeah, you. Person. Come here, you're a young adult. Friendly introduction. No! Come back! Don't- No! Yes! You're still technically near my lot. Come to my house. Come to my house where everything will be better for you. <laughs> can I just straight away invite him over? Is that a thing I can do? Da -da 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 -da. Wait, I can't. I have to sit here on the road? I don't want people to know my business. Ask to cloud gaze. Hey, random stranger. You want to stare at the clouds with me? So, uh, you single, mate? You, you single? He already wants it. You can just tell. You can just tell. He's like, ah, yeah. Sing you single? You single? Yes. Yes, you are going to be our new favorite customer. I don't even know. Tell a joke about ducks. Because that is how you reel a man in. You joke about freaking ducks. Mm-hmm. Get to know. I just need to know what you're into, baby. You're lazy. Well, if you get with Boo Boo, we get $2,000. Come to my house, come to my house, come to my house, come to my house. Come to my house. Invite to... Invite to my house! Where's that option? Invite to my house! Come to my house, sir. No, I'm not- Oh my god, do I have to take his ass somewhere? No. Can I just go to here together with- Yes. Come into my house, sir. Meet my wenches. Damn straight. Okay, boo-boo. It's your turn. It's it's all on you. You bang this man successfully, and we get two thousand dollars from the get go. Me, get out of here. Get out of here. Watch TV. Leave them alone. Hey, hey, you want to get with me and pay me money? <laughs> you know you want to get with the honey boo boo. You just know. Well, this is going. Well, so far. You already know if he's single. No! Come back! No! Where are you going? Where are you going, you bastard? Where in the hell do you think you're going? Oi! Why can't I click you? Group activities? Tell group story? What? Where are you go- What are you doing? You just get come into my house. He's like, this is too shady for me. These these wenches, man. All right. You're uncomfortable because you. Ha Why don't you get up if you have to pee? You, you batch. Go pee, dumbass. Oh, you were flirty. You were you were there. You were there and then you weren't. The hell. Oh, I can't work with you. You're a child. I can't- I can't work with that. D damn it. The game's like, no, don't look. Don't look. Don't scar her for life. There you are. You- you- how dare you not be... adult. D yeah. Okay. Alright. Let's just calm down. Now you're hungry. Why does everyone have needs? Why- why does everyone gotta be hungry and shit? <laughs> Uh, um, a salad. No, do not spend our money so recklessly. Oh my God, you bitch. Oh my God. No, where are you? Oh my, no, you are the queen of stupid. Resume cooking. I put this back in the fridge. No! It's $12. We'll never get back. Damn it. Just make the salad. Yes, cut yourself a thousand times. Well, and now I'm making the grilled cheese. So, I guess. We'll just have... No, me. You're gonna start a fire. No. For... Oh my god. This is the epitome of stupid. The epitome is stupid. Get in here and have some salad. 
Okay, we're all fat. We need to eat salads. Okay. Info. Seriously, you can't finish it simply because there's not room. And now I can't... Uh, Boo-boo, you bitch, you better not be taking none. Because I cannot handle this. Move your fat, sexy asses out of my way. Resume cooking. Go. Ah, what the fuck? Where? What? No! Snook, we're going to die. And now I can only clean it up. What the frick frack? What did we do? No. That was 12 fucking dollars. 12 fucking dollars we'll never get back because Honey Boo Boo was a tit. Or not Honey Boo Boo. Sex Pelican. Damn it. Sex Pelican, you don't get nothing today, okay? You're not allowed to anything. You're not even allowed to human. Okay? You're just gonna sit in your room and not do anything. I'm so pissed off I can't even look at him. <laughs> I'm just like, I can't deal with these bitches anymore. It's, it's awful. I just can't handle it.